PC Recruiter's candidate presentations feature makes it easy to send attractive, branded packages to your clients with all the key candidate details and attachments for their review, and to collect and monitor their feedback. With the latest PC Recruiter update, we've incorporated feedback from our users to make presentations easier and more intuitive to create, customize, and monitor, resulting in a more efficient placement process. The changes begin here, in the Presentation Template Setup screen, where you define with simple drag and drop which items of data you want to share with your hiring authorities. We've streamlined and consolidated the Settings panel to make options easier to identify and set, such as the enabling of resume and attachment downloads by the recipient. We've also updated the Field Selection area to make adding and removing fields from your presentation simpler. You can use the plus and minus icons to add and remove fields from view and use the pencil icon to give any field an alternate name when viewed by your client. When you're in the attachments area, you'll see that the file dates have been moved to the far right, better separating them from the attachment names. There have also been several improvements to the utility for adding header and footer images to the screen, including new options to repeat or stretch the image, giving you even more control over your branding. Now let's look at the changes you'll notice during the process of using the Candidate Presentations feature. We've added a new starting point for this process. You can now choose Create Presentation from the Action menu on a name record, in addition to starting from a roll-up or pipeline as before. Once you've opened a presentation to send, you'll see these new icons indicating sections that have no content, such as attachments that don't exist for the selected candidate. These segments will be skipped over when the presentation is generated. You'll notice enhancements while sending a presentation as well. The From option is now a drop-down that includes any additional aliases you've configured for your PC Recruiter username under System Email Alias List. The Recipient box has also been updated with a list of large, easily identifiable names. If a recipient has multiple email accounts on file, you can click here to select any alternate address. You can also make this change after selecting a recipient by clicking on their name and using this drop-down. After the presentation arrives in the recipient's inbox, they'll review the info and you'll receive an email notification that the presentation has been opened. Any fields in the presentation that contain a URL will now display a clickable link that opens in a new browser tab. Another email notification will arrive when the feedback has been submitted and the text of the feedback is now saved in the activity record. Let's look at the changes to viewing the feedback inside of PC Recruiter. On the pipeline, the Feedback column has been compacted into simple icons that display the number of feedback responses. Clicking on the feedback item, you'll see that we've upgraded the display, better separating the name, email, and star rating. We've also added in the date on which the feedback was recorded. When viewing a list of presentations, either from one of the records involved or from the overall presentation list under the system area, You'll see that there are now links directly to the relevant records, with easily identified color coding for names, positions, and companies. The Action button, which previously included only a link to edit the presentation, now includes an option to view the presentation as well. These improvements came from valuable feedback provided by PC Recruiter users following the initial release of the Candidate Presentations feature a few months ago. If you'd like to share your ideas about how PC Recruiter can improve your business, visit our Ideas and Suggestions forum at help.pcrecruiter.com. Stay up to date on PCR by following us on Twitter, Facebook, and LinkedIn.